Athens campus. We are located at the Student Health Care Center, which is adjacent to the Wellness Center, and I know that you all know exactly where that is. Small brick portion in the front is our office, the Wellness Center is in the back. Basically, we have merged health services and counseling services together, so we are now the Office of Health and Counseling Services, that would make sense. We follow a community-based model. So what we want you to look at the Student Health Center as is your doctor's office. Um, how many of you have been to the Student Health Center since June? Raise your hands. Okay, how many of you have been to the Student Health Center prior to June? Raise your hands. Okay, so what I see is several people have been prior to June, not so many have been after June. I think maybe the reason that some of you have not been back since June is because when you came to the Student Health Center, you may have been told the doctor's not in and you have to come back. So I don't know about you, but if I'm sick and I pull myself out of bed to get to the doctor's office, I don't necessarily want somebody to tell me you have to come back. The good news about that, we have sort of changed how things are working in our office. We have two medical doctors on staff, Dr. Michael Johnson and Dr. Vivian Hicks. We have a nurse practitioner, Beth Whitworth, a medical assistant, an LPN, and three licensed professional counselors in our office. Dr. Johnson and Dr. Hicks both have community practices outside of A&M, so they come in on a, you know, a few day basis to see students. Uh, what we want to do is make certain that you see us as your doctor's office. We can provide anything that your doctor's office that can be provide. Um, as far as the services that we provide, we want to make certain that we provide professional services and that your services are completely confidential. With the counseling, you never have to be concerned unless you come in to threaten to harm yourself or somebody else that we are going to call your parents and tell you what's going on, tell your parents what's going on with you. It's completely confidential, okay? If you're struggling with things, if you see your teammates struggling with things, it's pretty stressful to be an athlete and be a student and carry on relationships outside of that, make sure extra triggers, everything else that you do. So we encourage you to come into the Center for Services. Uh, we provide acute and preventative medical care, uh, tuberculosis screen testing, flu shots. How many people have had a flu shot? Raise your hand. Okay, not very many. I would really encourage you all to get a flu shot because we are on a campus and if flu does spread rapidly once, you know, somebody gets it, everybody gets it, and it's terrible to have a flu. It's really, really, really good experience. Um, we provide physical examinations, we do STD and HIV testing on site, we provide pregnancy testing, and something new that we're doing now, we are providing medical excuses on site. So you no longer have to go to Ms. Williams in order to get that excuse, we do provide that on site. Um, we do specialty referrals. Your student health insurance is included in tuition. So when you come to the Student Health Center, you do not pay anything, okay? The student health insurance is equivalent to the health insurance that the faculty and staff pays a large amount of money per month to receive. So in other words, come to our health center, no copay, no expenses. Uh, we can provide antibiotics, we provide uh, allergy, sinus, all those types of things. If it's a medication that we don't have, we will get it for you. Or if we cannot get it for you, we have prescription discount cards that you can use at your local pharmacy to hopefully reduce the cost of that medication. Um, 